um, Gregory McLaughlin. I served in Iraq and Afghanistan. And Greg, uh, can you tell us a little bit about your reaction to the artwork that you're seeing today? Um, pretty much the um, artwork was um, basically uh, women veterans um, who serve and um, haven't been recognized as they should have been. Um, to me, it's a powerful, um, it was a real powerful um, art exhibit, and it brought to light a lot of um, struggles that women have gone to, gone through. Mm -hmm. And what are what were some of the more powerful pieces that you felt really uh, reflected? You know, the reality of war and especially women in combat and so on. Well, the, the most powerful one that, well, the most powerful theme that I didn't know as a veteran who served almost 15 years is actual sexual assaults that's been um, that's been done to our female service members, the ones that's been reported and the ones that haven't been reported, and the actions that the lack of action by our command level, uh, which I found that was shocking. Um, which, you know, I don't know, I just felt that it was real shocking that the common thread between all the artists here is the sexual assaults that actually took place while serving in uniform. Mm -hmm. And what, what, do you, uh, what else do you hope that the public will gain by seeing this artwork? Um, recognizing. What, what message do you hope that they can take? Well, recognizing the women that actually served and recognizing that women are serving in combat just as much as the men are serving in combat. And um, some of the struggles that I did find that with women serving in combat is the same I found with minorities serving in combat. Um, doing, have to do the double the work just to be recognized um, um, or not being recognized at all. Um, but I hope that the general public realize that these women are serving, serving in combat and not just support roles. Um, most of these women um, served here um, from Vietnam on to the present conflict and I've never heard about these struggles that they have. So I'm glad I came here today which gave me a more of a deeper insight into their struggles. This uh, museum here seems to play a very uh important role to the veterans who relate to it, but also the public. Uh, is this your, this your first time visiting? Yeah, this is my first time. I didn't know, to be honest, I didn't know it was here. I'm glad I was invited out here. This is really important, especially, not just for veterans, but for everyone. We have to keep this place going because uh, I plan on coming back. I mean, I'm planning on coming back. The staff is really good. Um, they gave me the tour, plus I've seen pieces of equipment, that's Army equipment here that from 30 years ago that I worked on. So I thought that was pretty neat. Yeah. <laughs>